Hey guys, what's up? So today I am going to be giving some of my amazing advice because who better to ask than me, the person that doesn't know anything, uh, for advice. So here we go. The first question is that I'm actually good at is uh, killing people. Here's a pretty good one. How do I gain swag? So basically what you do is you want to wear sunglasses inside where it's pretty dark. Um, wear your hat backwards, um, <laughs> I don't even know what I'm talking about, what is swag? Do I, do I have swag? I, I, I don't, I don't know, nipples. Okay, this one says how to get over a guy, but I unfortunately don't know because I'm not over Johnny yet, so I'm gonna do how to get over a girl, or a guy. What I do is, if they have social media or any numbers or anything, if you have contact with them, Block, block, block. <laughs> like, just basically get them out of your life, get them out of your head. If it wasn't your choice of breaking up and you're, it's really hard to get over them, just block them out, block them on everything. Don't, like, try to communicate with them because all they want to do is see you upset for some reason because there, there's some pretty messed up people out there. But basically just block them out of your life and be happy, continue on without them, and enjoy life. So this person asked how to be bigger on YouTube or how to be like a success successful YouTuber. Um, basically all you need to do, this is like legit, um, why, did I, why did I just say legit? I don't, I don't, I don't use that word. The biggest thing that you need to do is be yourself. Seriously, like don't try to like be somebody else or be something that you're not because like, it's, it shows through that that's not really who you are, even though you might not see it yourself. People will be able to tell, well, people really won't be able to tell, but they can, like, sense something, and then it, like, they just won't like it. Like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, they don't see that that's not who you really are, but somewhere in their brain, it's like, I don't like this person, and I don't know why. Um, so basically, just literally... Be yourself, that's all you have to do. Like, from your heart, be yourself in everything you do. And that, that'll that get you places. If you're like, not yourself, yeah, I haven't seen anybody really like, go anywhere like that. You know, like, just express who you are. Like, don't be like, embarrassed of yourself. Do, do you. That's, that's the biggest thing you need to do. So this one's a pretty good one, how to survive a concert. Um. Basically, this is how I do it at least. If you go to a concert with like a, a lot of bands and you don't know, like some of the bands don't like go up in the very front because you don't know like what's gonna happen because you don't know if there's like a part in a song where everyone pulls out their guns and starts like firing it everywhere. So you just need to be aware of what's going on. And if it is your favorite band and you know what's gonna go down, be if, if you're okay with that, go up there and enjoy it. Just enjoy the concert. Um, and just like be aware of things, be aware of like people crowd surfing and people like when the mosh pits start, just be aware and just enjoy yourself. Go crazy, go in a mosh pit, it'll be okay unless you got that stupid person that's like throwing their fists and all that stuff, be aware of those people. But yeah, like I was in a mosh pit during Warped Tour and it wasn't bad, like people were nice, they picked you up if you fell down. And I lost my hat in there, and they freaking helped me find my hat. My hat. It's blue. You got it. And this one girl got pushed over to the ground, and like people would like, like push people away from like stepping on her. It was really nice. Like people are nice in there. They're not. They're not there to kill you unless they're the people with the band that the guns go everywhere. Then those people are. But other than that, no. <laughs> How to get people to like you. It's basically what I said about being like a YouTuber or whatever. Be yourself. That's, I, I know I say that for like everything, but literally like just be yourself. Um, don't try to like be friends with people that are like D-bags and stuff like that. I mean, just be friends with, with the nice people, you know? How to hide a body after you committed a murder. So yeah, like, like I said before, I'm, I'm pretty good at this, so... What you do is you get rid of, like, all of the evidence. Well, first, before you get rid of all the evidence, like, put your fingerprints on everything. And, like, um, I don't know, leave, like, something of yours that they know is yours. Like, leave, uh, your school ID or your, or your license or something. Leave it there, like, with the murder weapon. Because that just shows that, like, you weren't there and somebody was, like, trying to set you up. Because the cops would be like, 
There's no way. There's no way he'd just leave that there. And then his buddy would be like, yeah, yeah, dude, you're right. And, like, you're basically off the hook right there. So then they like, cross off your name of the people that could have done it. And you're good to go, bud. How to stay positive. Okay, so just think about the future. Don't really think about whatever's bringing you down at the moment. Just think about the future. Think about that you can make your future whatever you want. Um, just think about the good things in life. Think about the tiny things that are going on right now that are beautiful, like the frickin' sunrise or the sunset or the moon for this chance because it's really dark, the moon up there, just little craters and such, like, that's adorable, yeah, that should make you happy, dogs. <laughs> How to be Kyle David Hall, okay, so this one's, like, kind of hard because it's, it's a, it's, it's tough, it's tough being, being him, um, so what you gotta do is you have to basically... So yeah, that is my advice for you guys. Um, I asked you guys on Twitter, so follow me on Twitter right over here. No, over here, sorry, I'm putting the link over here. And this week on Pinata, I'll be picking two people to have one of my shirts of your choosing. So you can pick from either one, and you obviously get to pick your size, and yeet. So all you have to do is follow me on Pinata, and comment on the picture that is linked in the description. Yes, I love you guys so much. Peace out, and I will see you guys next time.